you'll be able to post that on multiple social media accounts all at once. So yes, it's essentially just like Hootsuite. Bam chicka wham wham! That's literally it, okay. No! No! Order a fancy drinks in the cafe. Oh, you so sexy, that's all you got, man. She bought a business and so. So it's Monday and I just got home. I'm actually gonna go ahead and hit the gym, hit a leg day. I won't take you guys along because to be honest, I'm honestly too shy right now to bring the camera in front of a lot of people at like five, six o'clock. So I think I might just end up bringing it either tomorrow or Wednesday maybe. And um, I have one of my buddies film me, so we'll see. But uh, I'm gonna hit the gym real quick and I'll um, catch you guys when I get back. All right, so we just got back from the gym. About to put a scoop of this, chug it real quick. We don't really want to leave ya. Live it up, we can live it up. Moving on them like a diva. No, what's up, no, what's up. Had to go down to me, drink up. I know you got me this. If you don't just take right up, but do I me just stand up to it? Bars, man, we can sit up my step. the next morning and um, yeah just before I start work I'm gonna get one leak of problem in and eat some Nesquik okay yeah so we got some Nesquik as our pre-workout and then I got some meat code up right here um, today's Legal practice is search a 2D matrix, as you can see there. So I'm gonna go ahead and watch this video and eat real quick and then try to solve the problem. Corner to be mid minus one. And else, the last case is if we actually- Just finished up working. Um, I'm gonna drink some of this juice right here. Look at this. Yeah, we're just gonna sip sip on this. And then we're gonna continue our coding project Okay, so I want to show you guys a project that I will be working on and what I'll be making these developer vlogs about. So it's called multi-post and essentially what it is is that you'll be able to log into multiple social media accounts and then you'll be greeted with a dashboard and in this dashboard you'll see all your recent content and see how well it did. And you'll also be able to essentially drag and drop a video or an image and you'll be able to post that on multiple social media accounts all at once. So yes, it's essentially just like Hootsuite, but I'm making, I'm planning on making this either entirely free or at a lower cost uh, per month. So yeah, you would essentially drag and drop your video or your image, and then you'd be able to fill a description caption, you know, you generate using AI, and this on and off switch essentially just means that, hey, I want to post to Instagram, and I don't want to post to Twitter. And uh, then you'll be able to schedule a post as well so after you finish uploading these the videos and images you'll be able to choose when you want to uh, post this so you don't have to worry about it no more 
and then you can hit the simply hit the post button. That's essentially like a high level overview of what I'm going to be doing. It's essentially just Hootsuite, but just free, um, at least for me for now. Um, and the tech stack I plan on using is this right here. So for front end, I plan on using Next.js. The reason being is because I want to have server side rendering. Uh, it would definitely make our site much faster and Next.js is just fun to work with. Um, we'll also be using Tailwind and Shetsian. As for our backend, we'll be using the Django. And the reason being is just because I want to have some experience using the Django uh, just in general. So that's literally the only reason why. Um, as well as Next. And we'll also be using AWS S3 as well to store our files. Now for other, we'll also be using OpenAI to generate our captions and our descriptions. And we'll also be using Stripe later down the line if I choose to make this a subscription-based uh, you know, what program, I guess you could say. So I will show you guys right here. Um, all right now, all it is is signed in to Facebook at the moment. And let's see if I can go here. Yeah, so you sign to Facebook and it then just sends your credentials to my backend. And then from my backend now, right here, I'm just grabbing the data and printing it out. That's literally it, that's all I got so far. Um, and I also created a serializer and a model for it. Gets the data, we go ahead and put into a new user, checks if it's valid, save it. After we save it, we then want to create a post thing, right? Because each time that happens, you create a new post, post regardless. Alright, morning guys. It's Friday morning and um, I'm gonna show you guys what I got for breakfast. So, this is what I got. I got a bagel, some apple, and some clementines. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna eat this up and then I'm gonna begin work and after work I'll catch you guys. Okay, well, it's Friday night and um, I'm pretty tired, so I'm just gonna, and kind of bored too. I decided not to code tonight and just to kind of take a, a little break because I was cutting all day for my job already. <laughs> and um, yeah, I just showed it to my girl. And I think I'm just gonna end up the night just reading this book right here. It's called The 48 Laws of Power. And so far, it's been pretty good. I'm like, 10 chapters in, I believe. So I'm gonna read this and then hit the bed, so. So 
ya.